This is the integration of the ChatGPT OpenAI writing tool. Let's just go ahead and see what the AI Assist can do to help kickstart our creativity. So I click on the AI Magic Assist button here and you'll see I have some basic prompt ideas. Let's start with an outline. I click on Submit. Now, this is running through the AI engine and it's going to come back with an outline that I can use to structure the article. So if I don't know exactly what I'm going to write about, sometimes it's good to have sort of a general outline to start with. And as you can see, it knocks it right out and I can go ahead and insert that in there. So once I get into here, you can see that the keyword research that was incorporated in this article is being highlighted by the text generated by the AI. So you've got an outline. What else can it do? Let's go in and have it create an introduction. You can put in whatever kind of prompt you want here. But introductions and conclusions, you can see it generates it right out here. So I go ahead and throw that in there. I'm going to need to clean that up and do some editing, but there's an introduction. Let's push the boundaries a little bit further. Right. Three paragraphs about the history of board game diplomacy and some famous people who have played it. So one of the things that I want you to be cautious about is using too much of the AI. I'm an expert on the board game of diplomacy. I've been playing it for 20 years. Pulling up basic facts and information so that I don't have to do the grunt work of typing it all out, that's fantastic. But the real insight that people would get from diplomacy comes from my input and my experience. So I can't just take this and chunk it into this article without doing any editing. This is where you kind of run up against the limits of it, right? Is you have expert knowledge that you bring to the table and the AI just doesn't have that. It's not creating anything new. It's pulling together words in a logical order based on other words that it knows. So with the caveat that you cannot trust what the AI creates, you must just use it as inspiration and helping you get unstuck and a place to kind of structure stuff out. I will say that what it does do is create good summaries. So conclusions. So let's go back in here and let's have it write the conclusion to the following article. And I'm just going to go ahead and paste in the text that we had above. And now we've got the conclusion of this article as it was written. Um, what do we want to call our article? It's, we're going to generate a new title for this one here. What's it going to come up with? There we go. The AI Revolution Board Game Edition becomes our title of our article. And now I can go ahead and put this up on my website. I hope this has been helpful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up on the Sage Discord or reach out to me, Chris, at sageseo.ai.